Hello, guys. Good evening. Are you there? Good evening. Hi, good evening. Good evening, miss. Oh, more people is getting connected, man. That's nice. That's nice. Okay, so we're just going to wait for more people to get connected just to start over with, uh, you know, like the class. So how was your day, guys, before starting? Was it good? Was it like kind of difficult? How was it? Uh, good evening, mister. Good evening. Okay. My quick update for you guys. Like, for example, Manuel, how was your your day today? Hello. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Uh, I'm okay. I'm okay. Today is only I stay in my, in my house. It's, I... Yeah, yeah, it's uh, my my thing is is broken. That is, I fix it. My thing. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. There you go. That's cool, man. That's cool. Okay, nice. What about you, Eduardo? What was your day today? Okay, my name was very messy. Uh huh. Because after meeting, um. Oh, very mm, <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right, there you go. Yeah, I mean, it's the first day of the week, you know, like, eh, tend to be a little bit eh, complicated sometimes. Okay, that's nice. Okay, so more people are getting connected. Estela, what about you? How was your day? Good evening. How much uh, it was nice. It was nice. Ah, it okay. was nice, nice. But I, I was very busy. But it's nice to to have a job. Okay, good, good. Yeah, I man. It's sometimes yeah. it's like very difficult, right? But yeah, it's worse <laughs> being without a job, right? <laughs> okay, there you go. All right, guys, I see that more people are getting connected. So I'm going to pass the attendance list just to start with the, you know, like the class instructions uh, as you generally have it uh, every uh, module starting. Yes. I have a question. Yes. Go on, mister. I will need a notebook. I am going to need a notebook. Probably, if you don't want to take notes on your computer, it will be useful ah. for you to, to, to get a, yeah, a notebook. Okay, and the computer better. Okay. All right, yeah. Okay, perfect. So just give me one second, guys. I'm just going to pass the attendance list. Carmen Eugenia. Is it here? Okay, no, just not here yet. Cristian Alejandro. Good evening. Hi, good evening, mister. Okay, so you're there. Daniel Archimedes. Mm -hmm. He's right getting connected right now. Yeah. Daniel Archimedes, you there? Can you hear me, sir? I guess he's just, just getting connected. He's getting ready for the audio. Daniel, can you hear me, sir? Okay, we're gonna give him a try later on. Uh, Daisy Maricela. She's getting connected as well. Uh, Edwin Alexander.
Elwin Alexander. Okay, so he's not here yet. Elwin Vladimir. Yes, good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening, sir. Okay, perfect. Ah, uh, Estela Mabel. Present. Okay, good. Let's move. Uh, Fatima Ale. Uh, let me see. Fatima Adriana. Hi, good evening. Hi, good evening. Okay, good. Fatima Lourdes. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Okay, good. Jaime Antonio. Jaime Antonio. Okay, so he's not here yet. Jose Eduardo. Okay, good. You're in a call. Uh, Carla Lisset. Carla Lisset. All right, so she's not here yet. Kenia Cecilia. Okay, so she's not connected yet. Lorena Beatriz. Lorena Beatriz. Okay, so she's not here yet. Manuel Antonio. Uh, present, teacher. Ah, okay. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Maria Gabriela. Good evening, present. Hi, okay. Good evening. Uh, Mari Raquel. Mari Raquel. Okay, so she's not here yet. Noemi Betsabe. Okay, that was a crazy name. Okay, but she's not here yet. Okay, cool. And the last one, Osvin Alexis. Okay, so it is not here yet. So he's not here yet. All right, guys. So we're going to start over. All right. So welcome to this uh, intermediate module number four. My name is Juan Carlos, and I am going to be your teacher, all right, during this module. Uh, I think this is the first time uh, I see everybody here. Yeah, I never had this, uh, any of you guys in my previous modules. So it's cool because we're going to work, you know, like from the better beginning. So as I said, uh, my name is Juan Carlos, and I would like to know you guys before, you know, starting up with that, just to get, you know, like each other's known. I don't know if you have been uh, together in the previous modules. Uh, sometimes there are like groups that are uh, split and separated. And there are some uh, groups in which they disappear and people are just getting joined from different groups. So I don't know how it's done with this group, but I would like to know you guys. I would like to know, uh, you know, like, what do you work on? Uh, uh, where do you live? And I'm going to start, like, you know, like myself in order for you to continue with that. As I said, my name is Juan Carlos. I live in San Miguel, all right? I'm from Oriente, all right? I am 29 years old and I am an English teacher, all right? So, but what about you guys? Any volunteer who wants to be the first one? You know, used to get to know each other. Okay, Eduardo. Me. Let's go, Mister. Okay. Good evening for everybody. Uh, I am Eduardo Jose Barrasta Cartagena. I am a physician in Bimbo, El Salvador. I live in San Salvador. Nice. Uh, I am forty-one years old. Okay. Uh, I, I don't look like forty-one years old, but I am forty-one. <laughs> Okay. 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 Uh, <laughs> what else? Well, mm. What do you like doing, for example? Uh, I like your hobby. Like, uh, my 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 hobby is 
taking care about my yard, my, yes, my yard. Okay. Um, I, I like I like to to listen music. I like the the TV shows like uh, Investigation. Ah, okay, good, good. And um, only that. Only that. Okay, perfect. That's it for you guys. All right, nice. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, any other volunteer who wants to say me? Hmm. I think just to be fair, since Eduardo was the first one, hey, nobody wants to participate. <laughs> Eduardo, choose one of your classmates. Who do you want to participate? But I can't see the all of the yeah, you cannot see uh, you cannot see them on the on the. You cannot. Uh, are you on your computer? Yes, I'm on the. Uh, okay, am in the good. Computer. And you see on uh, the right, on the right side ah, of the computer, okay. there is a part that it says view. Okay, you view. can select there, all right, and put it in gallery form. Gallery. Okay. Yeah. And you can see everybody there. Okay. Just one. I don't know. Maybe Daniel. <laughs> Daniel. Okay, Daniel. There you go. Okay. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, sir. So, uh, my, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Uh, my name is Daniel Archimedes Florentino Garcia. I live in Soyapango in San Salvador. Uh, no one is working in John Wang International in Zona Franca International at Oloquilda. Okay. Uh, I, I am pattern designer technician. Um, my job, my, my hobbies is have a trip to different countries, visit uh, Pueblo Vivos. Uh, I love it, go to the beach. Yeah, nice, I'm afraid nice. to the guitar. Yeah. Oh, I mean, that's cool, that's cool. That's cool, yeah. man. <laughs> so you love, love, love traveling. That's cool, man. That's really nice. Okay, very good, Daniel. Now. Can you choose any of your classmates just to continue with, uh, you know, like getting acquainted yeah. with each other? Uh, Manuel Escamilla. Okay, good. Okay. Let's Hello. Go. Can you uh, hear me? Yes. Okay. Uh, my name is Manuel Escamilla and I'm agronomist engineer and I, I work in as a consultant and an advisor for different companies. And I have one daughter and one grandchild. And I live in Santa Tecla. And my hobby is I, I like to climb the, monta the, the mountains and, and I like, I like to exercise. It's about three, three times um, per week. Nice. Um, and I, I like, um, I like to take care of my, 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 my garden, my, my garden. And, okay. and always, always uh, uh, take care of my, my my plant um, I like it. My plant is Chinese herb, and the the flowers is I like it. And I have a co I have a collection. The the this plant. Ah, really? I mean, that's nice. Yeah, yeah. Only that. <laughs> okay, very good. I see you like nature, man. That's cool. That's really cool. <laughs> Thank you. Same same here. The the uh, but. Uh, in my place in here, the good thing is like the advantage 
is that I live in the countryside. I don't, I don't live exactly in the city. So I have more space to plan. For example, uh, um, last week it was that I bought two avocado trees. We call it oh, that. really? Yeah, I mean, yeah. since you, since you know, prices are going higher and higher and higher. Uh, so <laughs> we need to plan it, you know, like cultivate. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, 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 but, uh, I, I like the, the, the feel. Um, that's that's why it's, it's my profession. And I don't miss engineer, but always live in San Salvador. But yeah. I love it. But I love it. Uh, I, I always love the nature. And that's, th really cool, that's why I study on, on master degree is management natural resources. And oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. And um, last week, I was I was in San Miguel, and oh, really? yeah, yeah, yeah. I was in San Miguel. I had freezing I had, San Miguel. What? Freezing, <laughs> freezing in San Miguel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, freezing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And and I was I I was I was I was how uh uh. I study, I imp impacting, uh, uh, I was study impacting environmental mm. and uh, for the extraction, the storm, mm. I, I don't know, I, I don't know, say, yeah. say is uh, sacar rocas. Yeah, 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 you said it correctly. Extraction storm, okay, okay. Oh, man, that's that, that San Michael is, the, the weather is really hot. <laughs> Like right now, <laughs> let me see. We got 31 degrees right now. So you can imagine the, the, how hot it is right now. 35, 35. Now. Right, now it's 30, right now it's 31 because you, you know, night is starting, but like at about three, between 10 and three, it's like almost 40 sometimes. Oh like my today, God. <laughs> almost 40. <laughs> so you can imagine how hard it is. Oh yeah, yeah. It's that. one day. It's only one day. I mm. I drinking is two two liters of water. <laughs> it's nothing, it's nothing swear in, in me. <laughs> exactly. So that's why people who, who lives in here, you know, and, and go to San Salvador, they say, ah man, this is a cooler place. This is a nicer place to live. And everything you know because the environment there is uh, way better than in here you know talking about <laughs> the weather okay well, that's cool mister okay all right manuel choose any of your classmates who hasn't participated just to continue up with it okay um fatima artiga ah, okay yo fatima artiga Are you there miss yeah, hi, good evening, everyone. Hi, hi, good evening. Well, my name is Fatmatika. I'm 26 years old. I'm working from Korea International or UPS, like all the people know the name. I'm the coordinator of customer experience in UPS here in El Salvador. And my hobbies maybe are watch a lot of movies and series and Netflix and HBO plus and I don't know, hang out with my friends. That's cool. Just that. Just that. Okay, I mean that's cool. That's cool. So you're a movies and series lover. Okay, I mean, that's nice. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> okay, perfect. Okay, just to continue up, choose any of your classmates. Um, maybe Maria Batres. Ah, okay. Maria Batres. Hi. Ah, okay, there you go. <laughs> Good evening. Uh, well, um, I'd like to be, well, I'd rather be called Daddy. And I'm 25 years old, and I'm currently studying at the university too. 
I oh. studied dentistry and also I work for a um like a law firm. Uh -huh. Uh, where uh, with my family, with my father and my brothers, uh, well, and I like my job because I like do like assistant of my dad. So mm -hmm. I try. I usually work with a lot of documents, and also at yeah, the university, I really like it. I like to be with the uh, patients and treat them with kindness, and also, um, well, I like what I do. That. Mm -hmm. um, I like to do or spend my, my time uh, watching series at the phone or probably sometimes uh, reading if I have enough time and that's all. <laughs> that's cool. That's cool. When you love what you do, so then it's not a job, right? It doesn't become a job. Okay, that's nice. Cool. Help me at choosing any of your classmates who hasn't participated. Um... Um, uh, Christian, Alejandro. Okay, good. Hello, good evening. It's good a evening, pleasure sir. to meet you. Um, my good name is Christian Ordoñez. I'm 28 years old. Uh, my occupation is graphic designer. Okay. I have like three, three years work in, in this place. Um, my hobbies are playing, playing with my dog um see some soap operas series movie especially in netflix and hbo um that's nice i start at level one uh um but i did the test to find to find out which level i i am mm -hmm. and i don't know many words and maybe i don't know how to use all the grammar that you are really uh, seeing but um I will try to do it in the best way. Thank you. Perfect, sir. Perfect. That's the, that's the, that's the best part you know, of it. And remember, it, it, in here, it's not just uh, focusing on grammar. It's mostly focusing on practicing what you know. Because English is mostly, and uh, not mostly about grammar, but mostly about, um, you know, memorizing words and put them into practice. Because uh, I don't know if that happens to you guys, but when we're learning a new language, you can have a variety of vocabulary words that you probably say, I mean, I know this word. I know how to say it. I know how to pronounce it. I know when another person is uh, you know, producing that word. But it happens sometimes uh, that the person next to you is talking and uh, that person maybe asks something to you and you don't know how to give an answer or to provide an answer. And that happens because of a lack of practice, right? So that's why it's really important. Mostly they practice the interaction because that makes you to reach a level in which you say, ah, now I don't think in Spanish in order to make that in English. So you don't put your brain to work twice, right? Two times at the same. So it's, it's, it's cool when you reach that, that point. All right, Christian, just to continue, choose any of your classmates. Um, maybe Edwin. Okay. What is Edwin? Ah, Edwin Vladimir. Are you there, mister? Yes, hi. Hi, everyone. Hi. Okay. Okay, well. Let me introduce you myself. Well, I'm from San Juan Opico, and my name is Edwin Vladimir Martinez Palma, but you can call me by my last name, uh, Palma. Uh, okay. It's no worries. Uh, currently, I'm working in the, well, I work in the town hall as a designer, and also, well, sometimes I, I went out, well, when I'm out, when I my spot, I like uh, taking pictures and well, my hobbies, uh, I have some, but the my principal hobbies, uh, I like play uh, football. And this is a little bit about me. It's nice okay. to meet you all. Okay, good to meet you and have you here, sir. Okay, good. Let me see who hasn't participated. Uh, 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 ah, we got another Edwin in here. Okay. Uh, Edwin Guidos, are you there?
Yeah, I'm here. Uh, good evening. Good evening, sir. Yeah, I am. Um, I am working right now. Um, I'm working for, from Bimbo del Salvador, okay. and I live but like I, uh, I'm from Soyapango. Okay. And my hobby is um, watch TV with my family. Okay. Um, I think that is all. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, no problem, sir. No problem. Okay. okay, it's good to have you here. All right, now let's continue up. Uh, Noemi, what can Hi. you tell us about your? Hi, good evening. My name good is evening. Noemi Garcia. Okay. I live in San Marcos. I work for GLC El Salvador. I am an assistant uh, import. Um, Ocean imports. Um, I enjoy to listen music, to listen music, and and I, I don't know. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I have five years to work in GLC. Okay. Um, I enjoy my work. It's a little hard but it's funny because every day I have uh, different things for now for knowledge um, okay. and I think it's a, a big world that you can know uh, different things every day oh, that's cool that's cool so the, then it's a challenging job that's nice that's nice okay thank good I mean thank you to you uh Mari Vallejo what can you tell us about yourself? Hi, good evening. Good evening. Uh, can you repeat the questions, please? I'm okay. <laughs> we, we want to know, uh, we really just know, getting to know each other in here. Uh, and what can you tell us about you? Well, where you live, what's your work? Uh, what do you like doing? Okay. Uh, well, my name is Mari Raquel Vallejo, and I work at uh, Bimbo El Salvador, and I am I am I am um, safety supervisor, okay. and I in my time free I I use um, um, practice with a puzzle. I don't know it's a court word. <laughs> Uh huh. Your puzzles. Yeah, I love it. Okay. And um, I live in Lourdes. <laughs> it's the reason to to be late <laughs> now. So okay. and I'm so happy to to be here because I I led uh, my learning English um, around maybe three years, and I I can finish. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And now we're, you know, on that way <laughs> to finish. Okay. Okay, nice to meet you. you. <laughs> nice to meet you too, sir. I mean, it's, uh, let me see. Estela. Yeah, Estela's missing. Hi, Estela. Hi. Tell us a little bit about you. Hello. Hello. Okay. Uh, my name is, is uh, Estela Mabel. I, I like uh, people... Uh, tell me, Mabel. Ah, okay. Um, yeah. I am. Um, I am secretary in UCA. I I enjoy to to read, to write. I love to write poems. I I like to uh, to walk, uh, but I don't have time to to do it. Um, okay. I I like to go to the beach. <laughs> um, it's nice uh, to spend time with my family and enjoy to the uh, a good uh, weather. Uh, just like that. <laughs> okay, just that. Okay, very good. Thank you for your participation. 
Uh, Daisy Maricela. Yeah, you're missing. Hi, good evening. Hi, good evening. My name is Daisy Maricela Mendez del Barenga. <clears throat> I live in San Juan Pico. Okay. Uh, I like to dance and to listen to music. Um, uh -huh. I am 40, 48 years old. Okay. And uh, I live with my family. Um, only that. Okay. Okay. There you go. That's enough. Thank you. Thank you, Miss. Okay. Now, uh, who's missing? I got the feeling that someone is missing. I'm missing. Lorena, have you participated? Yes, of course. Um, I'm Lorena Rivera. Good night. My name is Lorena Molina. Um, I'm living with my family in San Salvador. Okay. And I um, like to see movies okay. so much. That's so nice. nice. Okay, good. There are a lot of people who likes who likes watching movies and series of you. That's nice. That's pretty cool. I enjoy also watching movies and series, but in, in my case, sometimes I don't, I don't have that time to do it. I have, it's weird. I have paid a, a, a what is it called? Let me see. I pay some, I have pay something that is called IPTV, IPTV. Uh, in which it brings a lot of movies, a lot of series uh, from different uh, platforms and everything. I paid that like a month ago for six months and I just opened it one time. But, oh my God. But anyways, all right, guys, it, it's a pleasure to be here with, uh, with you. Okay, so, uh, and I hope we can practice, you know, a lot of things throughout this module. So we're gonna start over with uh, something that you already know, guys. And it's basically the requirements, you know, uh, of uh, the module. So I'm just gonna show you this information that you know already, but it is, you know, like for terms of requirements, it is necessary for you to get to know, to remember it. Give me one second. Okay, so this is the requirements. There is a presentation. Okay, over here. You know, as part of the program, uh, this is like uh, what INSA for requests for you guys, all right, to do. Okay, it's something that, that I guess all of you know, uh, but it, it is, you know, like important to, to keep it in mind, okay? Okay, so I'm gonna switch a little bit into Spanish just to read the requirements. Remember, uh, it says, nombre completo al conectarse a la plataforma. Let's remember that it's really necessary uh, to have your complete name in here because in support uh, checks the videos and everything and uh, what they want is just to be sure that the person that is enrolled in the program, that's the one that is taking the class, okay? Uh, then it says, in el caso de oyentes, agregar la palabra oyente, luego de su nombre. Eh, creo que en este caso no tengo ningún, ninguna persona que sea oyente, así que that's, that's, that's nice. Eh, la cámara encendida durante toda la sesión, eh, igual es un requerimiento que... Es bastante necesario, así que si están en casita, ok, si están there, pueden encender la cámara, ok, no, no, no van a estar todo el tiempo con la cámara apagada. Pues sí, porque a veces, digamos que estamos hablando, por ejemplo, Estela, are you there? Y Estela a lo mejor no está ahí. It's just an example, you know. Ok. Um, minimizar el sonido ambiente lo más posible. No sé si les ha pasado, pero eh, en algunas ocasiones a mí me ha pasado de que estamos en algún, digamos que estamos en algún tema de conversación o algún aspecto gramatical mencionando. 
alguien se le olvida apagar el micrófono y se escuchan conversaciones incómodas a veces. Entonces, para evitarnos ese tipo de, de, de conversaciones un tanto incómodas, entonces, eh, try to, you know, like, have your microphones off. Y participación activa. Eso sí, eh, en la mayoría de mis clases, a mí me gusta que, las, la, que, que, sea, que sea bastante participativo, ¿ok? Bueno, una pregunta, Grace. ¿Me, están, me, ¿me escuchan? ¿Bien? Entonces, I don't know if I am having problems with the internet o what? ¿Me escuchan? Can you confirm, guys, if you listen to me? Oops. I'm sorry, guys. Creo que tuve un pequeño corte de, de señal. Uh, I don't know if you can listen to me clearly. No sé si me escuchan bien. No me están escuchando cortado. Or something like that. Now it's okay. Ah, okay. There you go. Please, uh, I'm gonna project again the presentation. Si me están escuchando como cortado or you don't listen to me at all, please let me know, okay? Me lo hacen saber. Okay, where? ¿Dónde estábamos? Okay, here. Ok, as I was saying, como estaba diciendo, oh, oops. las clases sí, creo que con ustedes no van a tener ningún inconveniente en cuanto a la participación activa. Recuerden, entre más participemos, es mejor. Ok, why is it better? Because you have the chance to practice more, all right? The grammar function, the topic that we're going to be talking about maybe at that specific time. So, And that's what uh, I really like, okay? Active participation from you guys. Entonces, esos son los, digamos, como los requerimientos principales, eh, digamos, que pide el programa. Ahora bien, en cuanto a la asistencia. Uh, como siempre he sabido, en Safor, eh, pues, pide que la asistencia sea un 100% en las clases, aunque, pues, a veces... Eh, a veces por motivos laborales o mo motivos pues ya eh, alejado de digamos de las posibilidades de pasar acá eh, no se puede un 100% pero sí a la gran mayoría de, de clases ok la asistencia dice no se tomará solamente digamos al estar presente sino también a cumplir con la clase completa en este caso eh, en el pasado se solía tomar la asistencia en tres ocasiones, a las 8, 9 y 9, 55 más o menos, 10. Eh, ahora lo vamos a hacer nada más en dos ocasiones, ¿ok? Al inicio de la clase y al final de la clase, ¿ok? A las 8 y posiblemente 9, 55 más o menos que vayamos terminando. Y se tomará como válido igual escuchar al participante decir presente o present. In your case, it has to be uh, English. You know, since you're intermediate, it has to be in English. Ok. Uh, sesiones uno a uno disponibles. Recuerden, este tipo de sesiones es para aclarar cualquier duda que podamos tener con relación a el tema que se ha impartido eh, en esa clase o clases anteriores. All right. Eh, igual se mantienen los 10 minutos you know the feedback from that y pues como ya es bien sabido según el programa los permisos no están disponibles ok good, eso en cuanto a la insistencia creo que es, es you know like super super clear now what about us those guys tareas y evaluaciones ok, que es el otro aspecto bastante importante Ok. Si bien es sabido por ustedes, es necesario obtener el 80% en promedio de tareas y evaluaciones para poder completar el curso de manera satisfactoria. Ok. 
Okay, good. Thank you for telling me, Manuel. Um, creo que en este aspecto acá no vamos a tener ningún inconveniente, puesto que eh, ustedes van a estar trabajando eh, en las tareas y pues sé que me las van a completar todas, así que no vamos a tener problema en ese aspecto. Las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma justo después de cada clase. Eh, una pregunta, ¿ya todos tienen acceso a la plataforma? ¿Todos han podido acceder? ¿Todos han verificado si tienen el módulo asignado? Mm, no, yo no. Eh, sí. ¿no, ha vi, ¿No ha revisado? En mi caso, o, ajá. Mi, en mi caso no, yo entré y todavía sigo teniendo el módulo anterior. ¿Y todavía no se le ha asignado el módulo? El ah. módulo anterior tengo. Ah, ok, sí, no, no tiene este. Ok, perfecto. Entonces voy a notificar eso para que puedan para que puedan ayudarle y ya le aparezca el módulo que, que debes tener, ok, ya asignado. Ok, sí, luego al final eh, voy a mandar la información con su nombre. Eh, ¿Alguien más que todavía no tenga acceso al módulo en la plataforma? Es, eh, sinceramente, yo... No, I don't have any information about uh, this module. That's why I can't uh, review it. Uh, but uh, you don't have the link of the platform? Uh, not yet. Not yet? Uh, but uh, in the past, you, you had the, the previous modules? You could access no, the I modules? I, I am new. Uh, this is my first class in my first uh, model. Mm -hmm. well, um, but maybe, the, maybe. But the people from from English Corporativo to have sent you the uh, emails. In uh, in those emails, it should be the link for the platform in which you can enter there and. Uh, and access with the with the password that they provide you. Okay. Yeah, they, I'm going to check. Okay, check your email, the one that you provided to, Thank to you. the company, okay? If you don't have Thank access, you, okay, and if you can't access to that, uh, let me know so I can report that, okay? Okay. All right, there you go. Uh, let's continue with this. It says, todas las tareas y los temas de cubierto tienen que estar completos antes de cada... Oops, and there is a smart that has to be Friday a la medianoche, ya que ese registro es enviado al INSAFOR. Ok, va. En este caso, eh, la fecha límite para el examen de medio curso o midterm, you know, será el viernes 17 de marzo. Recuerden, este se hace la segunda semana. Ok. Eh, and then it says la fecha límite para terminar el examen final que en este caso sería eh, según los registros que yo tengo el viernes 14 de abril ok I have to reconfirm this specific date eh, porque creo que esto va a ser por motivos de Semana Santa ok, creo que va, habrá un, you know, un break in, 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 in that specific week So, but I need to reconfirm that and I will let you know later. Y luego dice el manual puede ser descargado en la plataforma y no se utilizará material terceros acá en ninguna sesión debido a que eh, el video es subido a la plataforma de YouTube y pues para evitar problemas de copyright and all those things, right? Ok, uh, ¿todos tienen ya el manual? Todos tienen ya el manual. Eh, la mayoría, bueno, o todos ya están en el grupo de WhatsApp. Sí. Ok, ¿hay yes. alguien que no tenga yeah, manual? No, no. Ok, yes. ¿Hay, ¿hay alguien que no tenga el manual y no esté en el grupo? Uh, I am in the group, I don't but have I don't the have group. the manual. You don't have the manual? And I, don't have the ma I, I have the manual. You don't have the manual and you're not in the group. Okay, give me one second. Let's do something before starting with this. This link I'm going to provide you here. It's the one that leads you to, to the WhatsApp group. So you can join. Give me one second. It's loading this thing. 
I'm gonna send you uh, through through here through Zoom. Okay, this is the link for the one who hasn't joined to the group. So you can click on it and join, okay? To the group. And uh, give me one now second. I, uh -huh. Now I send the manual in the, in the WhatsApp group. To the WhatsApp group? Okay, thank you, sir. I send the manual, okay. Yeah. I have a question. Yes, tell me. I I have the, the, the link in my in my, in my email. Mm -hmm. I click on this, mm -hmm. but I only open a website, English Corporativo, welcome. Mm -hmm. And this this say mm -hmm. register for create a new account. Register to create a new account a in the email is not provided any other information besides the link. Uh, no, only this. Is it not providing uh, questions? Uh, you have been invited to join English Intermediate Module, module 4 at onlineinglesorporativo.net by a member of the course staff. Please finish your registration and fill out the registration from making sure to use uh, my email. Um, I'll continue the, the link. Finish your registration. Finish your registration. Um, mm -hmm. Only that I don't have any uh, nickname or password. Okay, in in the registration there, where it says uh, register, put your email, the one that you provided to the to the you know like to the company there. And okay. uh, generally, generally the password is one, two, three, four, five. Is it generic? Okay. Let's try on, and if you can't access, let me know so I will report that. And uh, probably the, okay. these people are, are going to help you tomorrow with that. Okay, so, okay, perfect. I'm gonna resend uh, the, the, the manual because we have another student who joined to the group and probably it doesn't have it. Okay, there you go. I resend it again for the ones who who, who maybe don't have the, the manual. Okay, guys. So let's start with the topic that we're gonna be discussing tonight. Okay. Let me close this. Let me save this. Okay, so I just want to show you something before starting with the main things that we're going to be discussing. Um, give me a second. It is slow in this thing. Okay, teacher. I uh, I receive receive uh -huh. the 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 email uh -huh. with the name online and i i click in the link uh, mm -hmm. register okay i'm going to register fill the my my user is my email mm -hmm. and my password i don't know but uh, after that uh, the the information say that i need to activate my account and they sent me another email with link. Uh -huh. After I click in the activation, I can uh, put my email and mm -hmm. one, two, three, four, five. Click, mm -hmm. and now I am in English Intermediate Modulo 4, in IT 10. Okay. Okay, perfect. Now you are inside there. Okay, there you go, perfect. 
At the end, I will show you how to work in that, okay? At the end of the class, I will, I will show you how it's, it's, it's done and you can manage this part. Okay, good. So, Mary, you can not access? So you can't access, Mary? Okay, good. So I will report that as, as well, okay? Entonces voy a reportar eso para que le puedan ayudar eh, el día de mañana con okay. activación. Okay. Thank you because I I didn't receive. You didn't receive any okay, any, any information okay. or email. No, I did. I didn't receive any anything email. Ah, okay, that 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 is it's weird. But anyways, I will. Okay, no problem. I will report that. Okay. Thank you. Okay, perfect. So I want to show you this, guys. All right, this is the one. I want to show a short vocabulary about this, guys, before starting with uh, uh, the manual, because we're going to be working in the manual part of it. Okay. The topic that we're going to be discussing in the rest of the class is going to be advantages and disadvantages of distribution or distribution channels. Okay. When uh, you read there the topic and, it, you know, it's about distribution channels, what it comes to your mind? What do you think is that about? What do you think we might be talking about in this case? Distribution channels. Any idea that might come to your, to your mind? Mm, I don't know. It's maybe about um, distribution of products for, for the factory, maybe. Ah, okay. Very good. We're going that way. It's the way to, yeah, it's the way the, the factory have to um carry on the products for the clients maybe okay very good yeah i mean we're going that way so basically when we talk about distribution channels we're talking about the different ways in which a product can be distributed all right from the manufacturing process until the final consumer right but before in uh, before starting discussing a couple of questions that we have in the manual I would like to show you guys a couple of words that I consider it's a little bit necessary for you to keep in mind. But let's just start with this, a short class agenda. We've got the, the students' introduction, something that you did already, the program presentation, something that we just finished. And now I'm gonna show you something related to the topic that we're gonna be discussing. And then we're gonna work on the page nine from your manuals. Okay, let's start over with a short vocabulary words. Why don't you show you something here? And let's start with this word, retailer. Have you ever heard this word before, guys? Retailer? Any idea about what it might be a retailer? It's not like a reseller, a seller, no. Uh, about what? Uh, people who sell something? No. Ah, okay. It goes that way. It goes that way. Aha. What else? What else it might come to your to your mind, people? Because they retain. Maybe it's uh, uh, uh -huh. a person who rent. Is a person no, who no. rent? Who rent? Hmm. Uh, you mean who rent what? Who rent a house or something like that? A room? Sorry, but I listen to you very bad. Oh. You're connected, but sorry. Yes, I think like, I know why. The audio is slowly. Yeah, we, we continue with troubles with your really? audio. This is weird because this is the first time that happens. 
That's weird. Okay, but you continue listening to me badly? Maybe if you turn on your cam. That, that's, that's weird. Because I don't even have the... Let me see. I'm going to check the speed of my internet. Maybe that's, that's, that's the issue I'm having right now. And I mean, everything is working fine. <laughs> okay, this is, this is weird. Apparently I have a good internet right now. Okay, uh, but anyways, um, do you continue listen to me like, like a robotic voice, like slow? No, and now it's okay. Now it's okay. Okay. Yes. Let's see. Okay. So, uh, if you don't listen to me like very good, please keep me posted. You know, tell me. Okay. Let's start with this. Listen up. A retailer, basically, a retailer. It comes, oh, it works with sales, but I have a short definition about it. Okay. And uh, for that, I want. Give me one second. Fatima, could you please help me out reading the definition about uh, what a retailer is? Sure, a uh, retailer, a person or business that sells goods to the public in relatable small quantities for use or consumption rather than for resale. Ah, uh, okay. Having this short definition about a retailer, what do you think is that then? Mm. I don't know, it's like an entrepreneur, maybe. I don't know. It comes like a, a okay, it might be an entrepreneur. All right. But a retailer, in this case, it's a person or a group of people that forms a short, a, a small store, you could put it like that, and buy products and services. But in what? in uh, small quantities, okay? And uh, it might be just for their own usage or just for resale it, okay? Uh, in Spanish, this one, it will be like uh, minoristas. A retailer is a minorista, okay? A person who buy or oh, companies who buy things, in very, very low quantities, and they resell that product, or they use it for their own, you know, like consumption. So that's a retailer. It's okay. Sorry, or, it's okay to say it's a reseller too, or just a retailer? I don't know, I, I'm not. But a, a, a reseller, it is, it is okay to say a reseller. Yeah, it is basically the same thing because a reseller is a person or a group of people who buys uh, products and services in certain quantities and they what they do is like to resell the products. Yeah. Okay, thank you. There you go. Okay, let me understand. Uh -huh. The retailer, for example, is maybe I buy a box of eggs and I'm going to sell three and three to other people. I'm a retailer of X. Kind of That's like that, right. okay, might be like that. For example, let's suppose I have a farm, okay? Let's suppose I have a farm, okay? okay. And you come to me and tells me, hey, look, uh, I want a, a certain amount of eggs because I want to sell, okay, to sell eggs in my, my community where I live. So, but you buy me the product, but in a very low quantity. It's not a huge quantity, right? 
So mm. probably you're buying to me an average of uh, 100 eggs, just to put it like that as an example, right? And you sell them in, in the place where you live or, or uh, maybe a small store that you might have in there. So now you know the become, exactly. So now you become in a retailer because you're buying my product, but in a very low quantity, not in a huge quantity. Okay. So that's a retailer, basically. Okay. 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 Thank you. There you go. Good. So let's continue with this. So remember, a retailer, it might be a personal business that buy, okay, and sell products in a very low quantity. Now, consultant. This one, it will be like a little bit easier. What is a consultant? What do you guys think is a consultant? Uh, and maybe it's a person who you ask something and you hope that he answer you that you need to hear. Now, nah, okay, good. It goes that way. Very nice. Okay, let me see. I want to show the short definition I got about this. And I want Maria Gabriela to help me out reading, okay? Uh, consultant is a person who provides professional or expert advice in a particular field. Okay, there you go. It might be, you know, like advices related to any kind of a company position, all right, any kind of product that you might want to sell, but you don't know how to do it. So a consultant is a person that can help you up you know, to set up your goals or set up your, your products on the market. There you go. Okay, what about a distributor? Fatima? Lourdes? What do you think is a distributor? Uh, for me, a distributor is like a person who which job is like to sell to other people some product, maybe nah. in a bigger quantity than maybe. a retailer. Nah, okay. Maybe in a bigger quantity and a higher quantity. It might be possible. Okay, there you go. Thank you for your participation. Edwin, Vladimir, any idea besides what Fatima said? For you, what is a distributor? I'm sorry, okay, a distributor, it could be a person that provides any service or any product to another person. It, it like could be as the first example, like a retailer. Ah, okay, good. It goes like kind of similar to what Fatima said. Okay, very good. Thank you for your participation, sir. So in here, we got a short definition about this. The distributor. Lorena, help me out reading, please. Yes, of course. An, an agent who su supplies goods to stores and or business that sell business. to consumers. Okay, businesses that sells the consumer. Okay, in here a distributor is, let's put it this way. For a distributor, sometimes it doesn't matter if, if it is a retailer, uh, sell the products or, you know, take the products in small quantities or in huge quantities. It can be both ways sometimes, right? It depends on the store that you might have. It depends on the, the, the you know, like the small company that you want to raise and the quantity of products that you want to sell. So it will depend on that, uh, that a distributor will, you know, like give you the products. So, but basically it's an agent who supplies goods to stores and other businesses that sell to consumers. Okay, good. So let's quickly go on to this. This vocabulary, you have it in there, people in the manual. So we're gonna see that a little bit later. Give me one second. What is a wholesaler? 
wholesaler. What do you think is that? Yes, teacher. I got a, an idea about okay. that. Word. All right. Tell uh, me. It could be a bird, a person who is capable of sell anything. A person who can or any sell. Product. Okay. Okay. It goes that way. Good. Thank you, Edwin. Any other participation, guys? Any other idea that might come to your to your mind? Is the uh, people or the company that sells for big, big uh, quantities of the products? Ah, okay, good. So at the beginning, we were talking about retailers. So a retailer, what is the function of a retailer? To buy products and sell products in small quantities, right? A wholesaler, it's basically a person or a business who sell products or buy products, but in huge quantities, okay? So this is like the opposite of a retailer, okay? And we got it in here. All right, uh, let me see who can help me out reading. Estela, could you please help me out reading the definition we got here? Okay. Wholesalers, a personal company that sells goods in large quantities at low prices, typically to retailers. Ah, okay, there you go. There you go. So this is a person or company that sells goods in large quantities, right? In huge quantities at low prices, typically to retailers sometimes in some cases, right? There you go, good. So this was the vocabulary I wanted to show you guys. Uh, why did I show this vocabulary? Because we will need it later on in a short activity that we're gonna be doing in the manual. And we got the last one over here. Manufacturer's representative. Daniel, what do you think is that? Let me see. Any idea? <laughs> Let me see. Uh, it's a company that make make a uh, products for sale. I don't know. Maybe. Mm, okay. Okay. All right. Uh, it's a factory. I suppose that it's a factory. Uh, okay. But. Okay. Yeah, when we talk about manufacturers, okay, but we got the word representative. Representative, generally it's a person, right? A person who represents the factory or the manufacturer, right? So mm -hmm. it comes that way. Okay. But I got your idea, Daniel. Thank you. Okay. Any other participation, guys? Any other idea that you may have? Oswin. Oh, good night, teacher. Hi, Mister. Um, I, I believe it's a, it's a sales agency or company that sells in market a manufacturer product. Nah, okay, good. It comes a little bit similar to the 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 the. the Definition I got over here. Okay. Thank you, Oswin. Your name is Oswin, right? Yes, it's Oswin okay. with a B. Yeah, I thought it was Oswin. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't do that clearly. Okay, there you go. Thank you for your participation, Mr. It says, listen, manufacturer's representative is a sales agency or company that sells and markets a manufacturer's product to a wholesale customers. So basically here, a manufacturer's representative, it's like the ones on the top, those big companies who manufacture products, all right, and services, and they sell those products to wholesale customers, and then the wholesale customers 
uh, spread the product all over the retailers, right? So that's a super long chain, okay, uh, for the product to end up in the final consumer. Okay, good. So as I said, we're gonna see this vocabulary later on. And now guys, I want you to open up in your computers, the manual. And let's go into page number nine. Give me a second. Where is mine? Okay, here is The mine. distribution channel? Yes, the distribution channel. I'm not projected in here. Give me a second. There you have. That's the one. Okay, we got over here the distribution channel. It says in here express the advantages and disadvantages of direct and indirect distribution channels. And we got a couple of questions over here. And it says, does your company sell products and services directly to the consumers? What kinds of businesses distribute their products to, the, to other stores? Uh, for example, in the companies that you work for, uh, to any of you guys, does your company sell products and services directly to consumers? No. No? Okay. Anyone who does it? Any of the companies that you work for, guys? No, okay, good. So I guess uh, none of you work for that. Okay, there you go. So right after this couple of questions over here, we have a short conversation related to the topic that we're talking about, okay? And it says, Ellie and Joel are talking about options to distribute their products. It says they turn practice the conversations with a partner. So we got it this short conversation between Ellie and Joel. I'm gonna read the conversation one time and then guys, I'm gonna send you to start practicing in pairs this short conversation because I am inter I'm interested in listening to you guys, okay? Practicing this short conversation. So I'm gonna read it once just to, you know, like if you have any questions with the pronunciation or something like that, and then we're gonna practice it. It says, Ellie, I'm thinking about selling physical copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. It says, Joel, really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with distribution options. We sell everything directly to the consumer through our online store. And it says, me neither, me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. It says, Joel, let's give a try. And if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog at the store. There you go. Anywhere from here, guys, that you might uh, not know, oh, everything is okay. From the conversation, I hear. Entrepreneurs. Entrepreneur. Okay. Can somebody tell me what is an entrepreneur? Everybody knows what is that? In Spanish? Or in English? Whatever you want, sir. Uh, if it is English, better. The person who make some business for own. Okay, so an entrepreneur is a person who starts, uh, you know, their own business, starting with, uh, you might be selling tostadas, selling whatever thing, 
all right? But the idea is just to start a small business, okay? So that is an entrepreneur, okay? In Spanish, it's like an emprendedor, okay? That's what it is in Spanish. And now, I mean, a lot of entrepreneurs uh, are raising in, in, in this country, and that's really cool. Really cool. Good. Any other uh, vocabulary word, guys, that you might have any questions with? I think the vocabulary is pretty easy to identify here. Okay. If you don't have any question with this short vocabulary, people, from this conversation, let me see how many people I got. 16. Okay. Uh, for the ones who have the cameras off, do you guys continue the class? Are you there? Can you confirm if you're there? Edwin Alexander, Kenya, uh, Maria yes, Gabriela, Fatima. Can you participate? Aren't you busy, guys? Yes, I am here. Okay, perfect. Here you go. Yes, I'm here too. Okay, perfect. Yeah, okay. What are we going to do, guys? Listen up. For a couple of minutes, I'm going to send you to a breakout room to practice this short conversation, okay, in pairs. And we're going to come back in here, and I want to listen to you guys, okay, reading the conversation uh, as you did in the practice. So I'm going to stop sharing here this, and give me one second. You are 16 right now. Okay, perfect. Okay, cool. Let's practice that short conversation for a couple of minutes. Then we're going to come back in here, okay? Please accept that to enter to the breakout room. All right, Daisy, uh, Stella, do you enter? Le apareció Stella para poder acceder? I mean, Daisy. Uh, ¿Le apareció un pequeño mensajito ahí para poder acceder al breakout room? Si le aparece, déle aceptar para poder eh, ir a la práctica. Yes. Ok, give me one second. I will send that again to you so you can le start over again. Try now, please. Press accept, because then I'm going to move you from here. OK, now I'm going to send you to number five. Perfect. Now everybody's in purse. That's nice. Uh, si quieres ahora lo hacemos, lo hacemos al revés. Okay. 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 Uh, I'm Eli. Uh, I am thinking about selling physical copies of our audio training programs for entrepreneurs. Really? Well, we will need to check with consult. I don't have any experience with distribution options. We sell everything directly to the consumer through our online store. Me neither. That's okay. Okay, again. Okay. okay. Uh, I'm thinking about selling physical copies of our LD training program for entrepreneurs. Really? Well, 
we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with a distribution option. We sell everything directly to the customer throughout our online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let give me a try. And if it's a success, we can sell more from our catalog at the store. <laughs> Mr. Colju correct is correct our pronunciation or we had a trouble with to pronounce all right for example uh uh uh, uh like we're a entrepreneur entrepreneurs entrepreneur okay yeah that's i think that's that's the only one uh let's give it a try if it is a success okay and the the, the word catalog catalog God. What is catalog? The last in the last line from Joel. Catalog. Catalog. Yeah. catalog. Yeah. That's okay. what it is. Okay. There you go. Okay. Easy. Cool. All right. Okay. Thank you. You're going yes. good. What you can do is like switch uh, positions, right? Okay. Uh, yeah. I, I will start. Practice a little bit. Uh, I'm going to check uh, other person, then we're going to go back to the main session. Okay. Okay. okay thank you. Nice. Give a try. And if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog at the stores. Okay. Now you can, you can, well, we can repeat uh, as you are Ellie and as I, yo. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> I don't know what is the, the voice. <laughs> uh -huh, I don't know. We have to returns, maybe. What happened? Uh, Hi, teacher. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Are you practicing okay. back and forth? Yes. Um. Maybe. Maybe. Um. We we can start again, <laughs> Amelie. Um, I'm thinking about selling thick physical physical uh copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Okay, physical, physical, physical. Right. physical. There you go. Copies of uh, okay of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Entrepreneurs. There you go. Okay. Okay. Really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with distribution options. We sell everything directly to the consumer through our online store. Okay. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let's give a try. And if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog, catalog at the stores. Okay, very good. Excellent. I'm just gonna go and check another per and then we're gonna go back, okay? Okay. I will send you okay. uh, uh -huh, a finder where you can accept just to go back. Okay. Okay, I hello? am thinking about hello, Miss. Any uh, any word uh, from the conversation that you might have a problem with, or oh, everything is okay. For pronunci pr pronunciation, maybe entrepreneurs. Okay, entrepreneur, entrepreneur, entrepreneurs. There you go. Yes, entrepreneurs. entrepreneurs. Okay. Very good. Maybe for me, maybe. Only that. Just that one? Okay, good. What about you, Daisy? Yeah. The same word, entre entrepreneurs. Yeah, I yeah, know. that one. Entrepreneur. 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 There you go. Huh? Okay. That's what okay. It is. 
Okay. Um, I'll start again. Okay. I am thinking about selling or online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let's give a try. Uh, the new business that they will to do. Now you ask to me, number two. Okay. Do Joel and Ellie have experience with you done, girls? Okay. Nice. Nice. Yes, teacher. Okay. Cool. Cool. So if you're done, so let's go back to the main section and I want to listen to you all, okay? Okay. All right. See you there. Oh, time to listen to you guys here. I'll tell you, give me one second, I'm just going to... Mm -hmm. Project the manual. What did I do? Ah, yeah. Who wants to be the first pair of participants? Which pair wants to break up the ice? Maybe I. <laughs> Maybe you. Okay, cool. Who did you work with? Um, Fatima. Okay, with Fatima. Where is Fatima? Ah, Fatima. We got two Fatimas. Me. Fatima. Ah, okay. Fatima Artiga. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, I'm Ellie. I'm thinking about selling physical copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Entrepreneurs? Okay. Really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with distribution options. We sell everything di directly to the consumer through our online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let's give a try. And if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog at the store. At the stores. Okay, there you go. Thank you, Fatima. And thank you, Mary. You did it correctly. Okay, thank you. Okay, who wants to be next? Me. Okay, cool. Who do you work with, yes, sir? Hi, okay. <clears throat> ah, with Estela, okay, let's go. Yes. I'm thinking about selling physical copies of our audio training program for you? entrepreneurs. 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 Really? Well, we will need to check with that consultant. I don't have any experience with the distribution options. We sell everything directly to the consumer through or online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit they could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let's give a try. And if it's a success, we can sell more for our catalog at the store. At the stores, okay, thank you. Estela and Eduardo, you did it excellent. Okay, who wants to be next? Me, me, teacher. Okay, first Christian and then you, Daniel, okay? Okay. okay. I work with Edwin, maybe? I with Edwin, okay. Yes, sir. Okay, uh, me first. 
I'm thinking about selling physical copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with distribution option. We sell everything directly to the customer through our online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around, see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let's give a try. And if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog at store. Okay, very good. Thank you. Edwin and Chris, you did it excellent. Now, Danielle, who do you work with? Yeah, with Fatima Lopez. <laughs> Okay, good. Let's go. Okay, I'm Ellie. I'm thinking okay. about selling physical copies of our audit training program from entrepreneurs. Really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with distribution option. We sell everything directly to the customer throughout our online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retailer store. Let's give it a try. And um, if it is a success, we call sell more from our catalog at the store. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Fatima and Daniel. You did it excellent. Yeah. All right. Who's next? Nobody wants to say me. Okay, good. I'm gonna choose them. Uh Daisy. <laughs> Uh, you work with Noemi, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Let's go. Okay. Hi, sir. I am thinking about selling physical copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Really? Well, we will need to check with the concept. I don't have any experience with distribution option. We sell everything directly to the customer through our me neither maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could with it with from a partnership with a retailer store retailer store let's give a try and did it and if it is a success successful we can success we can sell more from our catalog at stores at like a store. Okay, there you go. Thank you, Daisy. And Noemi, you did it excellent. Now, uh, Maria Gabriela, you haven't participated, right? Who do you work with? Yes, we read. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, I was with Lorena. Okay, good. Let's go. Lorena, would you, would you like to be Ellie or Joel? Ellie. Okay. I'm thinking about selling physical copies of audio training program for entrepreneurs. Really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with distribution options. We sell everything direct, direct to, the cons, to the customer through our mm -hmm. online store. Me neither. Maybe we call us as around and he's, he, oh, pardon. And see. Maybe call on around and see how much profit we call with we call it from a partnership with our retail store. Let's give a try. And if it's a success, we can sell more from our catalog at stores. Okay, there you go. Thank you, Maria and Lorena. Okay, now uh Manuel. I haven't seen you practicing this theory. How do you work with? With me. Okay, cool. Let's go. I think. <laughs> okay. Okay, Kenya. I think about selling physical copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Really? Well, we will need to check with a consultant. I don't have any experience with it with distribution option. We sell everything directly to the consumer through our online store. Me neither. 
maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retail store. Let's give a try. And if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog at a store. Our catalog at a store. Okay, there you go. Thank you to you both. You did it excellent. Thank you. All right, Ozobin. Got it. Okay. And yeah, practice, Mr. Who do you work okay. with? If I'm not grown of being, you were working with Elwin, right? Yes, with me. Oh, ah, okay. There you go. Osvin, can you listen to me? Uh, Maybe he's not oh, available. Oh, Osvin, he, he's there, but I think... Excuse me. <laughs> you got the microphone now. That's why. Yes, yes. Okay, <laughs> good. I'm ready. Okay, I'm ready. let's go. Okay, I am thinking of selling physical copies of our audio training program for entrepreneurs. Really? Well, we need to share with a consultant. I don't have any experience with distribution options. We sell everything directly to the customer through our mm -hmm. online store. Me neither. Maybe we could ask around and see how much profit we could get from a partnership with a retail store. Let's give a try. And if it is a success, we can sell more from our catalog at the stores. Okay, very good. Thank you to you both. You did it excellent. Okay, and I guess you guys were the last per um, participating. Let me see. Because Kenny, I think, is, has participated already. Kenya, did you participate already? I don't remember. Yes, with Manuel. Ah, okay. There you go. Okay, perfect, guys. Listen up. What are we going to be doing next? Uh, we're going to go again into the breakout rooms, but in this case, not about practicing conversations. We're going to be discussing these questions and uh, the last uh, activity that we're going to be doing in the manual at uh, this, 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 this class. Listen up. It says, per work, discuss the answers to the questions below. It says, how does Ellie want to expand their business? Okay, I'm going to send you again to work in pairs and give an answer to these questions, okay? According to the conversation that you have pre previously uh, practiced. And then question two, it says, do Joel and Ellie have experience with direct distribution channels? Explain to me right here if they had experience or not. What indirect distribution channel are they considering? Put it in here, according to the conversation. When you finish uh, you know, giving an answer to these three questions, let's go down, guys, to the exercise four over here, where it says, match the terms to the corresponding meaning. In here, you got the terms retailer, consultant, distributor, uh, wholesaler, manufacturer's representative. And in here, you got a short definition. This one is a little bit different in compared to the one I show you, all right? But you will know how to do it. In here, in here, in this space over here, you can put the name, uh, I mean, the number, the number in the corresponding, uh, you know, Definition over here, okay? Good. Any question about what you're going to do? No? Okay. No, go. that's good. Nice. So I'm gonna stop sharing this and uh, let's go again.
estamos, no tengo el manual. Who doesn't have the menu? Uh, Edwin. Edwin, are you in the in the WhatsApp group, Edwin? Yeah. You are there? Yeah, I don't, I don't open. I am, I am in the class and on the computer of my work and and uh, my cell phone. Oh, okay. So that's why you can't, you you don't you don't have it. Yeah. No. Right now. Yeah, I I have. Ah, okay. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, because I already uh, resend it again. I forwarded it again uh, into the WhatsApp group, the manual. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Okay. Uh, how does Ellie want to work? Selling from a partnership with a retailer store. Yes. What do you think? Uh, um, what direct distribution channel are they considering? Uh, the Joel say we can sell more from our catalog at the store. Mm, yes, could get from partnership with our retail store. Uh -huh. They are considering gets from a partnership with a retail store. I think. Are you agree with me, Fatima? Yes, uh, because it's a indirect way. Uh, they don't. They won't sell directly to the customers. They mm -hmm. will be. There will be a retailer. Yeah. Yes. Okay, we have the, the answer in our mind because we great. <laughs> okay, yes. this this yes. the last one. Okay, match the term on the corresponding meaning. Number one. Okay, and number five. An individual agent, agency, or company that sells and manufactures products. Maybe, maybe it's possible. Um, online store. Uh, the question says, "What indirect distribution channel?" are they considering? I think if the first one is uh, selling physical copies, but I don't, I'm not sure if, if that uh, sell more from our catalog at the stores is a distribution channel too. Yeah, because I, I think maybe um, this question is about um, the way um, in Ellie and Joel think of self. Maybe is the way is um, is Ellie wants to expand her business selling copies or audio training program for entrepreneurs. It's the first one. And the second one, and Joel and Ellie doesn't have experience with indirect, indirect distribution channels. And the third one's Hmm. 
lista, ok. Minoristas eh, o a los minoristas. Then the fear is number three. Retailer. A person or business that sell goods in public in a small quantity for use. Right. Yeah. The retailer is a person. Yeah. We finish. Reviews. Yeah. I think so. It's finished. <laughs> I think so. We finish. Yeah. Internet distribution fund. So. Let me see. Yeah. Uh, 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 da, 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 da. Wholesaler. Let me see. What is a wholesaler? You got it number two. An agent who supplies goods to store and other businesses that sells to consumers. Uh, what is a wholesaler? Do you remember at the beginning of the class that we were talking about that? What yeah. is a wholesaler? The, so the wholesaler is the, the people of, of the store we distribute the, 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 the distributor, distributor mm -hmm. the product and a lot of quantity. Mm. Ah. Maybe we have to change the. Uh, 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 why, why can you? The, the distrib distributor, distributor is the number two. And wholesalers is the number one. There you go. Why? Because it says a wholesaler is an intermediate uh, uh, an intermediary entity in the distribution channel that buys in bulk. Buy in bulk significa comprar in big quantities. All right. Let's buy in bulk. And buy sells the resellers. Exactly. In bulk, bulk is, is a synonym of big quantity, a large quantity of something. Okay. Okay. It's a description. Bulk, bulk is, is, is synonym. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Then distributor is the number two. All right. And I think supply so goods to store and other business that's uh, to okay. consumer. And now, teacher, it's okay. <laughs> uh, let me see. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Yeah, okay, good. Uh huh. Nice. Okay, thank you. There you go. I'm just going to go and bulk. check. Okay. Bulk. Bulk. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, it means, remember, big quantity of something, okay? That's okay. Yeah. Okay. I, I'm just going to go ahead and, and, and watch uh, one more participant per, and then we're going to go back, okay? Okay. Okay. Bye. Sure. Are you about okay. to finish, guys? You don't finish that three, uh, four, um, one, one, two, two, and five, and five. Ah, you got them all. Okay, there you go. So we're gonna check that. Uh, uh, when we get to the main section. I'm just gonna check one more participant in here and then we're gonna go back to the main section, okay? Nice. Okay. Hello, ladies. Are you done? Yes, teacher. Ah, okay, nice, nice. Okay, good. So if you're done, I would like to listen what you got in the main section, okay? Let's go now. See you there. Okay, we finished.
Okay, very good. So everybody's coming. We're just going to check the information that you guys have. So let's wait for everybody just to get connected. We got six people connected now. Where is the rest? Have they gone already? <laughs> All right, just give us a second. Ah, they are coming. All right, while well, they're just getting joined, uh, I am going to show the manual again. Give me one second. It ain't the manual. Ah, here it is. Okay, good. So everybody's in here. Uh, now, uh, Lorena, could you please read question number one from the exercise three? I want you to read the question for me, please. Mm, how does Eddie want to spend your business? Uh, their business. Their business. Okay, okay good. Business. Who do you work with? Uh, you work with Maria, right? Yes. Nice, mm -hmm. Maria. What do you answer? Uh, what What do you put as an answer on that question? Uh, they are thinking. Oh, well, she's thinking about selling. I am sorry, my computer. Um, she's thinking about uh selling physical copies of her audio training program for entrepreneurs. Ah, uh, okay. There you go. That's what it is. And I guess everybody got that one. Okay. Thank you, Maria and Lorena. Perfect. Now, uh, let's move. Fatima, help me reading the question number two, please. Okay. Uh, do Joel and Ellie have experience with indirect distribution channels? Okay, cool. Uh, Daniel was working with you, right? Yes. Okay, Daniel. Yes. Um, answer that question, Mister. According to what you were discussing with her, according to the excuse that they don't have any experience, uh, any experience to with indirect distribution chat. And uh, let me see. No, they having any experience. Ah, okay. Good. There you go. So they don't have any experience, right? within the direct distribution channels because they uh, sell their products directly to the consumers, right? There okay. you go. Okay, very good. Thank you. Yeah, it is correct. Thank you guys. Uh, now, Elwin, uh, Vladimir, you please help me out reading the question. And the last one. Yeah, the last one, number three. Okay. What indirect distribution channel are they considering? Okay. What indirect distribution channel are they considering? Okay. Who were you working with? Uh, Os Osvin. Osvin? Okay. Osvin, according to what you were practicing with Edwin, uh, what was that indirect distribution channel that they were considering? Yes. Um, they are considering a retail store. Okay, very good. They are considering a retailer store. The, do everybody got that one? The retailer store? Okay, if so, yeah, that's the correct answer, right? They are considering a retailer store. Okay, good. So we're done with number three. Now let's jump into number four. It says, Match the terms to the corresponding meaning. Okay, good. Give me a second. Do, 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 do. Someone who hasn't participated that much. Manuel. Okay, Manuel. I want you to read the definition in here. This definition. Number one definition. Only the definition, please. You got the microphone off, mister. Sorry, 
Okay. An intermediate entity in the distribution channel that buy and block and sell to resell. Ah, okay. And sell is, to sellers. Okay. Good. Is who who late who late seller? Wholesaler. Wholesaler. Okay. Wholesaler. Do everybody agree that is a wholesaler? Number one. No. Yes, for me. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Why, why is, uh, some people says no and some people says it's correct? Who says no? Think, uh -huh. I think this is the correct answer is manufacturer representative. A manufacturer representative. Uh, sorry, sorry. But, it's, but, it's but, return. sorry. Uh, okay, okay. But uh, listen to the to the to the definition. It says, "Oh, give me one second. It says an intermediary entity in the distribution channel that buys in bulk. Buys in bulk means buy in big quantities." Okay, and sells to resellers or retailers in this case. That's okay. So, so since since it says in here uh, that buys in bulk, it means that is who seller, who less seller, wholesaler, wholesaler, wholesaler. There you go. Okay. So that in Spanish is what is a wholesaler? Mayorista. Okay, there you go. Good. So let's write down in here number one. Okay, good. Uh, let's continue with this. Who, who hasn't participated? Let me see. Christian, could you please help me reading the definition number two? Yes. Um, an engine who supplies goods to a store and other business that sell to consumers. Okay, good. An agent uh, who supplies goods to store and other businesses that sells to consumers. What is that? Uh, you ask me, you ask to me? To everybody, okay. If okay, you want to yeah. answer. Oh, you're going to answer? Uh, distrib yeah. Distributor. Distributor. Distributor? Yes. Okay. Everybody agree on that? I agree. Okay. Yeah. You got distributor? Yes, okay, cool. There you go. So then it is a distributor. So we got number two over here. Nice. Okay. Mary, could you please help me out reading number three? Sure. Yeah. A person or business that sells goods to the public in small quantities for use. Okay. Which one is it? Is a retailer. Okay. Does everybody agree that is a, a retailer? Number yes. three? Yes. Okay. This is a retailer. Yes, teacher. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Good. Uh, Daisy, help me read number four. Daisy, you have the microphone off. I'm sorry. A professional who provides expert advice in a particular uh -huh. era, social, social distribution logistics. Okay, such so as distribution logistics. Okay, which number is that? I mean, uh, on which uh, definition you will put that? Concept, actually. Manufacturers representatives or consultant? Consultant. Consultant. Does everybody agree that is a consultant? Yes. Yeah, consultant. Ah, okay, so in here, I'm gonna cut number four. Okay, good. And let's let's read the last one. Fati Martia, could you please help me in reading the last one? Yeah, sure. Uh, an individual agency or company that sells and manufactures products to wholesale and retail customers. Ah, okay, good. Very good. So basically, that is a 
manufacturers are representative, right? So in here, we're just gonna write down number five. So I guess everybody got this ones, right? Okay, very good. All right, guys. Thank you for the participation of tonight. By tomorrow, we will continue with the same topic, but in different, with different concepts. All right, we're gonna see the like the different channels that we got uh for distributions and we will consider the advantages and disadvantages of them at the moment of uh, distributing a product. So I will go ahead and pass the attendance list just to finish up the class. But before finishing up the class, do you guys have any questions? No questions? Okay, cool. Good. For the ones who got problems uh, to enter to the platform, please uh, send me a, a message to the WhatsApp group. So I will uh, forward the, the information to the people uh, from English Corporativo so they can help you out tomorrow fixing up uh, uh, the, the platform, okay, for you guys. Teacher, yes, I can please? enter in the WhatsApp group. You cannot enter? No. Are you from your your are you in your cell phone right now? Yes. Okay, good. Uh, you have soon on your cell phone, right? Right now. Yes, yes. Okay, I will send here again. Um give me one second. The link so you can join. Okay. There you go. Thanks. I, I, I sent the link there so you can join. Okay, okay. you should be there. Nice. Any any other question, guys, related to the class? Um, teacher, excuse me. Yes. What about the what what about the, the homework for tomorrow? Okay, good. Listen up, guys. The homework is already there in the platform. Okay. Homework is already there in the platform. Give me one second. Okay, if you go here to Yeah, give me one second, give me one second. Oops, I had it here. Okay, good. So if you go here, guys, this is like uh, the, the wig one that we're working right now. We're working right now, so let's give a click on here. By tomorrow, it will appear on you guys the video from this class over here okay right now it's it's not nothing but in here you have that here you have the homework okay from this class so here read what you got over here and you got the options in there to choose okay and then just send the information okay remember that the platform is just a mean uh it's a tool for you to practice okay what we discuss in the class so in here if you want to move on with homework and and you understand uh, uh what's the homework about you can move on okay uh just to say that if you want to make uh for example if you want to finish uh homework number two so it is acceptable okay nobody's going to say uh, just like oh no don't do it okay it's a way of practice. It's a way of having an extra practice so you can do it. So here you got, remember, from homework one to homework number five, okay? Good. So you got it there then. If you have any questions with this, uh, you can send a text message to the, to the WhatsApp group and I will help you out, okay? In uh, something that you might have problems with. So now I'll go ahead and give me one second and pass the attendance list just to finish up with the class. Carmen Eugenia. Oh, okay, so no, not here. Cristian Alejandro. Present. Okay, good. Daniel Arquimedes. Present. Okay, good. Uh, Christian, by the way, since Carmen is not here, so I'm going to have the 10 minutes feedback with you, okay? Okay. 
Okay, nice, sir. Okay, Daniel Archimedes is there. Daisy Maricela. Present. Okay, Edwin Alexander. Present. Okay, perfect. Edwin Vladimir. Present. Okay, perfect. Estela Mabel. Present. Okay, perfect. Fatima Adriana. Present. Okay, good. Fatima Lourdes. Present. Excellent. Jaime Antonio. <coughs> Jaime Antonio. Okay, so not here. Jose Eduardo. The present, the five name is Eduardo Jose. Jose uh, Eduardo Jose is your name. Eduardo Jose Barraza, sí. Ok, aquí se lo pusieron al revés, ok. Voy a mandar para que lo modifiquen, ok. All right. Sí, porque tengo José Eduardo. Ok. Uh, Carla Lisset. Carla Lisset. ¿De cuál? Un niño de las dos. Ok, so she's not here. Uh, Kenia Cecilia. Present teacher. Ah, ok, nice. Lorena Beatriz. Present. Ok, excellent. Manuel Antonio. Present, teacher. Ok, nice. María Gabriela. Present. Ok, Mary Raquel. Present. Ok, Noemi Betsabe. Present. Ok, good. And uh, the last one, Oswin Alexis. Present. Okay, good. So it was a pleasure to have here to have you here in the first class, guys. That's what for you tomorrow, okay? See you tomorrow in the second okay, video conference. Bye, bye, guys. Bye. Night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Have a wonderful bye. night. Bye bye. bye. Okay, there you go, Christian. So let's remember this this time is just for us to basically talk about any kind of issue that you might have, okay, related to what we have been discussing in the class or something that you might want to ask related to the platform, okay, something that you might not understand like fully during the class time. So I don't know okay, yeah. if you have any question. Yeah, well, I have uh, some troubles with my platform because uh, I I was in the last course that I got, but I changed my my email and mm -hmm. when I was in the in the course, and maybe that's why I am not in the in the actual course. Oh, give me give me one second. I will check your your email the one that appears in here yeah maybe it's uh assistant uh, the mercad assistant guion mercadeo exactly that's what i got uh -huh. here and i use my my personal email oh and that's why but i i don't know if i should change my email to my company email or or what yeah, basically, because uh, that's the email that, that is in here. So basically, uh, they sent you the information to that email. So you're registered yes. to that email. So, uh, yeah, um, I don't know if you have access to that email. Yes, I have. I have, but I don't know if I have to do a, another account. Uh, no, 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 not exactly. I mean, enter with your credentials using that email. Okay. And uh, the module should appear there in the platform. But because... I did, I did it, and uh -huh. uh, it, it didn't, it didn't work me. Really? What What does it says? Uh, it says sorry. that my email it doesn't appear. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because uh, this is the email I got for you here, Asistente Guion Mercadeo. It, it says that I have to create a new account. 
Uh -huh. You have to create a new account. Yeah. And uh, have you have you received any email from Inglés Corporativo to, to, to that email? Yes. I received that and mm -hmm. uh, the, the screen that it showed me, it say that I have to create a new account or if I have an account, I can log in, mm -hmm. but uh, I can I can log with my with my last account, and we can, I can change the email, but uh, it, it, it I don't know if it could be a problem. Oh, yes, actually, it might be a problem because according to 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 the information I got here. The email, the official email for you, is like assistant young mercadeo. So every oh. kind of uh, update, it will be there to that email. Mm -hmm. That's the issue. But let's let's do something. I will uh, ask for that information if you can change the email, so you can put your personal email. I will I will ask for that tomorrow. And if they tell me that you cannot change it, so uh, you have to create a new account. Okay, no problem. All right. Okay, okay. I will. I will send a message to to the technician, to the technicians tomorrow, and depending on what they say, I will let you know. Okay, I will just okay. copy. Uh, give me one second. I will just copy your name in here, so I don't. I won't forget it. Give me one second. Yeah, because sometimes it's a trouble because since uh, all these papers are going to support directly, uh, it's difficult sometimes to make a modification. Christian Alejandro Ordonez Arevalo. You're in the group, right? In the WhatsApp yeah. group? Okay, yep. perfect. Uh, if they notify me something about that changed, I will let you know, okay? Uh, okay. Through a text message on WhatsApp, okay? okay? Thank you. Very good. So that's that's the only issue that you have, right? Yes, that, uh, yes. Okay, very good. So probably by noon tomorrow, I will let you know about that, okay? Okay, well, okay, okay. thank you. All right, perfect, sir. So. Let's see you tomorrow, okay? See you tomorrow. Good night, mister. Okay, so the class is already done. See you the next time.